I'm not gonna bother checking the boiler room. Wait a minute. Hang on, let's pause. Ah, this all makes sense. This all makes sense. Get out. I've just deduced. I think I figured out everything. I think my clock theory is correct. So if I hang on, if I turn the time to uh, twelve o'clock on the clock tower, I am what the mindset I have. What, what I'm thinking is that the piano I can like interact with it or open it and f uh, find the object from within, which I'm gonna need for something. And this gold medallion it uh, allows me to control the time. I'm guessing. And what enforces my, my idea and what kind of makes me think I'm correct is the fact that uh, the time the clock has to be for the alchemy lab is 10 o'clock and the clock, the time for the clock right now is 10 o'clock. So there we go. I could a interact with the hand because it was 10 o'clock. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking I'm right. I, I'm sure I am. We haven't checked the boiler room, but I'm assuming turn in the time to the corresponding time for the boiler room will allow me to interact with something in the boiler room. That's what I'm guessing. Alright, so now we can go for this door, I guess. Oh, no, wait. Maybe I need a silver one as well. The tower is locked. Yeah, what's this on the other side? The hand stopped at 12 o'clock. Okay, so pulling in the medallion? No. Was it 12 o'clock before? Or was it 10 o'clock before? Maybe pulling in the gold medallion changed the time. Either way, we got to go back to the music room. We're supposed to go to the music room at 12 o'clock, which the time is 12 o'clock. So what? I'm the time was like 10 o'clock earlier though, right? I think, if I'm, if I'm right. Hang on a second. I'm pretty sure I read somewhere that there's some... Like, I think the nurses only react to sound and light. So, now I, the light is off. Maybe the creatures can't see me now. This is pretty worrying, I will admit. I am on edge. I'm worried I might run right into one. Oh. I think he saw me. Okay, to the music rooms. Wait, these are generic classrooms, in there. Guess not. Okay, so what's the deal with the piano? There's blood on some of the keys. Does this mean anything? Check this piano, of course. Why wouldn't I? Maybe I have to hit all of the not broken keys at once. I I'm guessing I've got to hit all of the not broken keys at once. Damn, I think I hit the wrong one. Okay, let's try again. Nope, I guess not. Ah, I didn't see that key. Okay, this key works. Ah, uh, it didn't seem to work. Ah, the black things don't work at all. It's just like, there we go. Like it's on the left, thus it works. If it's on the right, this key. the black things basically don't, you know, whatever. They're not there. Let's just say they're not there. Hang on. So the keys that work are, ah, right, then. So it's this one, this one, this one, this one. Did I hit them all. Uh, Where, but let's check. There's probably something in this room, like some music notes or something. It's written in blood. A tale of birds without a voice.
First through the greedy pavement, eager for the reward. Uh, first, um, I don't know, maybe that's referring to the first piano key. Uh, that may be the one all the way on the right side. I'm probably talking shit here. He, he flew as far as he could, so maybe that's referring to the key all the way on the right. As, as far as way as possible from the first one. Yep, okay, these are definitely telling me the things. Hang on, I'm writing this down. How do I go... Can, no, I, I, you can't go back. Okay. So, a tale of birds without a voice. First through the greedy pelican. So, he was... That's piano key number one. So, okay. Pelican, piano key number one. Then the dove is piano key number... Well, wherever is on the end. Well, it's six, wherever. I don't know what's on the end. How many keys there were. A raven flies in hi uh, higher than the dove, just to show he can. And quickly to a stop yawning and then napping. Who will show the wee way? Who will hold the key? Who will lead to the silver reward? So this puzzle, once completed, gives you that silver thing. Okay. But hang on. So assuming the pelican is the first piano key, the dove flow beyond the pelican and as far as he could. So like I'm assuming he flew to the key all the way on the right. He flew way beyond the pelican as far as he could, so the piano key all the way on the right. That's like that's, that's what I'm assuming. Piano key. So Pelican, we can agree on being the first ever piano key. So let's do the greedy Pelican, eager for the reward. White wings flailing. A raven flies in, flying higher than a dove. But how can you fly higher than the dove when he's all the way on the right anyway? Maybe he's talking about the black key. I'm not sure what they're called. I don't play the piano, obviously. Just to show that he can. Uh, so the raven is higher than the dove. Raven higher dove. A swan glides in to find a peaceful spot next to another bird. Swan peaceful next to bird. Uh, finally comes the crow coming quickly to a stop. Crow quickly to stop. Who will show the way? Who will who, who will be the key? Who will lead to the silver reward? Nope, not helpful. Screw you. You. This just confuses me. Is there anything else in this room? I guess not. Okay, let's go back to the piano. It's bloody piano. So, uh, the pelican... The pl yeah, sure. Check the piano, of course. So, the, was, it the, the, I, the, was it the pelican's greedy or something? So, I, I don't know. I guess it just comes in... It swoops down straight away or something, I guess. Comes in. Then the dove flies as far as he can. The raver flies higher than the dove. How's that possible? So, the, all right, let's try this. Bum, dun, dun, dun. Oh, this one. I clicked the wrong one. Black. Oh, they, it does work. Okay. Damn, we even got a black key working over here. It's not good. This complicates matters. Uh, Greedy Pelican flies in first. The other dude flies over here. The other one flies higher. Damn, wrong one. Swan, peace. Then the swan comes, uh, finds a peaceful spot next to another boo. That I don't know. Uh, crow quickly comes to a stop. Damn! I what? What the hell is this talking about? Hang on. Turn the page. I need some 
Right, uh, let's just map this out. Plus, some of the keys doesn't mean anything. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Yes or no? Oh, of course I do. Three, four, five, six, seven. Six, seven. I need to mark down which one of these work and which ones don't. Hang on, let's test this out. Bang, boom. So, this one works, this one works. Then the one on the end works. As for these black things. That one works. And then only one of these do, I think. Yeah. Okay. So let's back up for a moment. Let's have a look at this again. A tail's a boob about a voice. Uh, first flew the greedy pelican. A uh, greedy pelican eager for the reward, whatever that means. White wings flailing. Then came a silent dove flying beyond. Then dove flies beyond pelican. As far as possible, as far as he could. But they also say he's silent. Are those black keys like silent or something? A raven. Uh, okay, a raven flies highest. A raven flies higher to show he can. Can. Swan glides in to find a peaceful spot. Next to another bird. Finally, oh god, oh my god, there's another one. There's five all together. So, the crow quickly to a stop. Yawning and then napping. Who will show the way? Who will be the key? Who will lead to the silver reward? All of them? I don't know. Screw you. Okay, so... Yeah, yeah, yes. Okay. Greedy, the pelican is eager for the rewards. I, I don't know what that means. Maybe the first key. Bang. Uh, what's this? S something flies beyond the pelican as far as he could silently. So, this one. That's silent. It doesn't make a noise. Then, what's this? A raven flies... He flies, um, what's it, like above the dove to show that he can. There you go. He just flew further. The swan glides to... What's it? The swan glides to find a peaceful spot. Yeah, next to another bird. I think I got the first three, uh, first three keys correct. So then, a swan glides to find a peaceful spot next to another bird. Peaceful spot next to another bird. Gee, this one maybe? No idea. Then the crow quickly stops to yawn. Well, I strongly, strongly believe that it goes... That one... I strongly believe it's these first three ones. They are correct, I believe. Then the swan glides to find a peaceful spot next to another bird. Um, I, well, he's next, he's next to the dove then. And then the crow quickly stops. Yawning. I have 
no idea. No wrong way then. This one, this one, this one. I wonder if the blood on the pianos have any significance. If the dude found us a, a was a peaceful spot next to another dude, well, I don't know. Is this peaceful? I guess he's up on his own, so since it's higher than the other keys, so he's peaceful up there. And he has to be next to another boot, which he is. He's next to the boot, uh, dove. And then the crow quickly comes to a stop, yawning and napping. He's on a peaceful spot because he's high up, away from everyone else. And he's right next to the dove, so he's still next to a boot. May, I may have to uh, look up a guide for this. This one's tricky. Let's try every single key possible. So, that's this one. Now, let's try this one. We're gonna try every palm uh, combination possible. I did this in Doom 3 to find the combination to the room with the BFG. And it ended up being in the like 800s, so I went through like almost every single possible combination of numbers just to get the BFG gun. It's crazy. Maybe the blood represents how high the birds are flying. I'm just throwing that out there. I guess that's possible. Okay, so if the blood represents how high the birds are flying, the greedy pelican, eager for a reward. God damn this game. Um, this, I think this is the peaceful spot up here. Let's have another look. It's written in blood. Okay. Uh, first through the greedy pelican eager for the reward. White wings flailing. Okay, so... White wings flailing. Flailing. Uh, as far as he could. That's self-explanatory. Hang on, let's go back. Can we go back? No, we have to skip through it all. Okay, so what's the last guy? Uh, flying beyond the pelican as far as he could. Okay. A raven flies in, flying higher than the dove, just to show that he can. Okay. Higher, 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 higher. So, number three is higher. Uh, and then a swan glides. Stress the word glides. Uh, four, four glide peaceful. Uh, finally, out comes a crow, coming quickly to a stop, yawning and napping. Crow, quickly to a stop. Right, let's try again. How long have I spent in this puzzle, man? It's been like, I don't know, 20 minutes, I'm guessing. Let's try again. My newfound knowledge or ideas. Okay, uh, flailing. None of these really look like there's wings flailing. Maybe that maybe this one. Flies further just to show he can. Flies higher. This one is higher. Oh, it could be this one then. Alright, let's go with wings flailing. No, that looks like wings flailing. Peaceful spot next to another bird. And then one of them quickly stops yawning and then napping. So wings flailing, I don't know, maybe that's it. Um, as far as he can, the other guy flies a bit further just to show he can. Some dudes in a peaceful spot. Oh, damn it, screw it, I'm looking up a guy, I can't do this.